It's been tough, but I'm trying not to blame myself too much. Don't, honestly. There's so much pressure to be perfect all the time. I know, I just probably shouldn't have constantly been late to work though. Maybe they wouldn't have fired me. It is weird that they didn't just let you work from home. It did. I just didn't want to because I was having that affair with Brian from accounts. Look, if you felt the need to find affection from someone else, which you did. Yes. And your husband isn't doing enough. Also, I had to get the bus to work, which was always late. And that is not your fault. Right? Like, they just had to suspend my license for speeding. Shh, ridiculous. And the only reason I was speeding was because I'd just kidnapped that Afghan hound, which, you know, I've always wanted one of those dogs. And you needed it for your mental health. It's not like I can afford to buy one. Shh, not in this economy. Especially with how much I'm paying that lawyer to sort out the arson case. And might I add, that building was decrepit. I did them a favour by burning it down. Exactly. Like, should you have waited for all the kids to get out of the nursery first? Probably. But you know what they say? In order to rise from its own ashes, a phoenix first must burn. Probably shouldn't have poisoned all those elderly people though. That was an accident. No, it wasn't. The fact that you successfully concocted a brew that immediately killed four people is actually pretty impressive. Hello, women in STEM. I do wonder though, if some of these issues might actually be my fault. Do not talk like that. It feels like no one has cut you any slack. Cuts. Oh my god, all those stabbings I did too. Oh, I'm such a mess. You killed what? 14 people? 23. Doesn't even make a dent in the overpopulation issue. Time's up, ladies. Already. Fred Star Angel. Can you just give us a minute to say goodbye? Make it quick. Thanks, Kevin. Such a madness. I do try to be done. I love you. Do not let any of these negative thoughts make you think you're not an amazing person, alright? Thanks, Helen. I appreciate it. Slay Queen.